February 2020 edition of Ask the Grizzly. Uh, got us some questions sent in um, that kind of goes back into restorative arts uh, type stuff, um, specifically on ways to create stability in your shoulders and also to rehabilitate like rotator cuff type sprains. Uh, so just want to say, you know, if you got something going on, you know, consult the physician. Everything that I'm about to show you is for informational purposes only. Um, but so what I'm going to be demonstrating today is a routine that I actually do for myself to keep my shoulders stable. I try to do it two or three times a week. It's a routine called the Rock for Five. Okay, so there's various ways of doing this. Um, you can use a piece of TheraBand. You know, if you've got a pulley system, like you'll see over here that we use in here, that'll work. Typically what I use on a week, week, week basis is just a piece of tube, exercise tubing. It doesn't have to be anything heavy. Okay, you just want enough resistance that by the time you get to the end of the, ten, the, end of the tenth rep, you start to feel a little bit of burn, okay? So, um, I like to just take like a solid surface, anything that I can just kind of wrap this around. I double up just because like the single thread of tube is weak, too weak by itself. First exercise we're going to start with is extension. Okay, so the line of pole is pulling away from the origin of where you've got your tubing anchor. So keeping my elbow pretty much straight, I'm pulling straight back so that my hand goes parallel to my waist. That's exercise number one, that is shoulder extension. So what I can do from here, I kind of want to start so that the tubing is moving in front of me. I'm keeping my elbow at a 90 degree angle and I'm going into external rotation. I want to keep my elbow pinned to my side I don't want my elbow to flare. I want everything to be kind of rotating like a hinge here at my shoulder. From here, I'm gonna to switch to like a thumb down grip. Some people will go thumb up, okay? I just prefer thumb down, okay? And what I'm about to do is abduction, okay? So keeping my arm basically straight, I'm going out to the side. Okay, so now I'm gonna switch hands. So the origin, the anchor for the tubing is behind me. And now I'm gonna do shoulder flexion. So still keeping my arm straight so that all the motion is occurring at the shoulder. And just go straight in front of me. Finally, medial rotation. So similar positioning as external rotation, except now when I rotate, it's pulling the band in front of me as such. That's the Rockwood 5. So good for shoulder rehabilitation, creating stability in your rotator cuffs. So you have flexion, extension, abduction, external rotation, and medial rotation. I am the Grizzly, and this is your February 2020 episode of Ask the Grizzly. Please like and subscribe so you can get updates whenever we publish new episodes.
Southeastern Sambo Association is proud to announce our partnership with Shinto Fightwear. Shinto Fightwear is a supplier of martial arts uniforms, casual apparel, and training equipment to include sparring gear. Members of the Southeastern Sambo Association receive a promo code for 10% discounts good for the length of their annual membership. Please sign up as a member for the Southeastern Sambo Association to support scholarship funds for local athletes wishing to compete at the national level and receive your discount for Shinto Fightwear, martial arts, clothing, equipment, and supplies today.